Developmental disabilities, the broad term, used to refer to a range of conditions that affect children's development across mental, physical, social or intellectual functioning. Some of the most common developmental disabilities are attention deficit hyperactivity disorder, autism spectrum disorder, intellectual disabilities, learning disabilities, cerebral palsy, vision impairment, hearing impairment, and impairment in language and communication due to other reasons. In any developmental disability, the features of the condition are expected to be present in early life and are usually present across the lifespan in some form or the other. Parents and doctors will notice at least some features of the developmental disability in the first few years of life, though there are some forms of developmental disability that may be recognized or diagnosed later. For instance, a learning disability may only be diagnosed after a child has attended a few years of formal schooling. That being said, if a condition first appears in late teenage years or in adulthood, it is unlikely to be a developmental disability. If you are concerned about your child's development or worried that there may be a developmental delay, please do not wait and definitely reach out to a professional or an organization that works with children's developmental issues. The first thing would be a developmental assessment or an assessment of your child's development in different areas like communication, movement, ability to think and learn new concepts. Next. The professional will have a discussion with you about your child's strengths and difficulties. And finally, they will definitely connect you with resources or therapists who will then chalk out a specific plan for your child about how to support your child's development. All children develop differently. However, there are specific ages in which children pick up developmental skills, also known as milestones, across physical, social, emotional, intellectual, and language functioning. Children with developmental disabilities, however, either pick up these skills slower than other children, not at all, or maybe in ways that are different from other children of their age. Just as you and your child's doctor discuss how your child is staying healthy, and gaining weight over the year. Similarly, it's important to watch and note over time how your child meets the typical developmental milestones or skills related to development of communication or how your child talks and listens, how does he or she move around, play with other children and learn new skills. If you know or come across any child with a developmental disability, please interact with the child with a developmental dis disability just as you would do with any other child. Greet them respectfully. Look at them in the eye, even if they do not look at you directly. Talk to them and show an interest in what is it that they are doing. Maybe greet them with a handshake or a high five. With this in mind, always be sensitive. If you meet a child in a wheelchair, Please to go down on your knees so that you can look at them directly in the eye. Try to avoid sudden approaches or abrupt movements. And always seek permission. Please do not presume. For instance, um, we need to step in the other room. Is that okay with you? Or uh, do you need help? with going to the other room or with your wheelchair being wheeled into over there. And yes, just remember to be your kind, respectful selves. If you found the video useful, please hit the like button and do subscribe.